so word on the street is that you guys want uh, more spookware. Uh, so I've come to bring you more spookware. Um, let's get in this heckin' temple and uh, find the masters and beat their trials to unlock their taste, res their tasty recipes, their taste challenges, taste recipes, food. You guys know where I'm going with this. Enter the temple of infinite taste. Of course, of course we will. Ooh, it's very short. It's very small. Hello. Begin the trial of the flavors. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I like. I'm, we're in, we're in an elevator? Hello. Master of Salt, welcome to the Temple of Infinite Taste, young ones. Do you seek to master the flavors? We heard this is the place to get really good at cooking. Ah, patience, my student. Cooking is, I feel a sneeze coming on. You guys ever feel like you have to sneeze and then it goes away and you're just in suffering for the rest of your life. That's what I'm going through right now. Cooking is but the dessert to the five course meal of the flavors. Cooking is but the dessert to the five course meal of the flavors. If you master all five flavors, then you can truly cook. Wait, there are five flavors? Precisely, red one. I shall be the one to introduce you to salt. Speak to me again when you're ready. Uh, I'm born ready. Okay, so how does one master salt exactly? Yeah, don't you just pinch it on burgers or something? Salt is the core of all taste, young ones. It may seem simple, but it has the power to enhance all meals. Like the violent waves of the seas from whence it came. You too shall strike balance between tranquility and strength. Not too salty, not too not salty. Got it. Open your mind to the oceans of salt and hear the waves. Learn the ultimate salt recipe. Oh my. Cut the fish. Oh! I didn't know I could move it back and forth. Yes, I'll try again. Not today, fishies. Not today! Fresh from the ocean. I like the little sliding panels. Hey, I think I get it. Salt is a simple flavor, but it can pack a lot of punch. Tranquil, yet able to carve mountains. Like water, my friend. Wow, righty. That's very profound. Yes, I definitely did not just quote a movie. Hey, let's move on to floor number two. Floor number three. Number three? Yeah. Well, yes, because technically the ground floor is floor one, right? I believe. I believe that's the case. Hello. You must be bitter. Is that a miniature sun? It's so bright. Lesson number one. Do not look straight at the sun. Though the sun is a mighty ball of fire, when controlled, it can be a great pleasure. You just need the right tool. And by tool, you mean the panel behind you, right? So that you're in the shade? No, the tool you need is perseverance. How is perseverance going to protect you from the sun? With per perseverance, you can overcome great hardships. Like the sharp, pungent taste of bitterness. It can be overcome with pure perseverance. Thanks, but no thanks. I'll take the shade. Learn the ultimate bitter recipe. The traveler in the shade. Sunstroke. I... You gotta fail at these games one time. One time to understand exactly what is happening here. My dude. He's so quick. Listen, my man. What? Excuse me. Finally returned home. You better get your butt home. I see now. Though bitter is unpleasant, with perseverance, it can be overcome. 
or you could just not eat it. Righty's, Righty's got the the uh, common sense answer to these questions. Even if Mitty needs to understand philosophically what what is going on here, I like this little this little garden inside. That's pretty sweet. Wow, it smells great in here. Yeah, I think I'll take a nap. Welcome, friends, to my garden of sweetness. It may be small, but even a teaspoon of sugar. Oh, you gotta try these berries, man. So, good. So, sweet. Yes, sweetness is a gift to the world. But overabundance can be a trap. Take only a few berries, friends. A good life is but with a small bite from the fortune of nature. Give me, give me them fruit. Oh. Oh no! I gotta like, I gotta layer them appropriately. Hell yeah. The riches of nature. So, though sugar may be sweet, you gotta take it in small doses to stay healthy. And a really good dish is a healthy one. Yeah, like ice cream. Righty and ice cream, man. It's really all he cares about. And milk, but you could say milk is ice cream because they're both dairy products, right? Are you umami? How do I get to you? Sour. The pit of sourness is a deep one. It is dark, distasteful, unpleasant. Is this guy okay? But it calls for me. I can hear my name echoing through it. Yeah, okay, this guy is not okay. Hell yeah. I didn't do anything! I literally didn't touch any buttons and I won. I'm not sure what I learned here. I guess the acid, soury taste is pretty bad. Though, some people really like it. Yeah, let's get out of here. Shouldn't we help that guy? No, we're just gonna let him be. That was great. I literally just didn't touch any buttons on my keyboard and won the, won the game. This is umami. Umami is a fun word to say. Umami. Just, just say it. Just say it out loud right now. Umami. It's a fun word. I see you brothers have come a long way. Skipped out of class, solved a murder mystery, and now you want to become a master cook, green one. How do you? Ah, uh, I know all. It comes with the job. Now that you've mastered all of their flavors, are you ready to learn the most mysterious? Only when you truly know the taste of umami. Only then you know cooking. Of course. Pluck the mushrooms. What? Oh boy. Got off to a bad start. Hell yeah. Ooh, that was very close. I think I get it. All the flavors. They work together to create amazing sensations. Like a great soup of artistry. Wow, Mitty, you sound like you really know your stuff now. Don't forget us little guys when you're a big famous chef. Your adventure is far from concluded. I see great dangers, but yet greater adventure for your brothers. Go back to your restaurant and show the world what you've learned. I unlocked Disciple of Infinite Taste. We go up to get to the entrance. Very mysterious. Yeah, man. Get on a bus. Let's go make some truly wonderful dishes. I like how this guy stayed here the whole time and didn't go with us to the uh, to the temple.
Alright, let's do some cooking. I'm stuck. I think it's time to open the restaurant again. With the new recipes we learned from the temple, nothing can stop us. I'll use everything the Temple of Infinite Taste taught us. Let's hope that Critic comes by and gives us a good review. That could really boost our sales. Open the restaurant. Let's go for it. This one's pretty freaking tough. the keys. Uh, oh, this has got to be the critic. He's the boss, huh? No, no Sparatu. Get out of here. No Sparatu. that one. Wow, what a busy day. Seems like our business is turning out quite successful. A few more days of work and we can buy our own cruise. Something's off, though. Where is that critic that was going to review our restaurant? Oh, no. 
What was that? It's coming closer. Could it be the critic? Oh, oh, oh. Playtime is over. You have stalled enough. It is time to come with me. Come with you? Don't you want to try out the food? Have you come to barter with me, mortal? Very well. Let us strike a deal. This is really weird critic. Stump me with your finest dish. And you carry on to come another day. However, should you fail, you will go with me willingly. What does he mean with glowing with going with him? Lefty, not now. I'm about to prove my worth as a chef. I accept your deal, critic. The pact is sealed. All right, time to do this. Make some soup, add water. What? And set to a boil. Okay, add whole tomatoes. Add chopped carrot. Add pepper. Stir soup to taste. Hell yeah. That was actually pretty good. It's my own recipe. I call it soup a la midienne. A deal is a deal. Your persistence to remain in the dream is admirable. Perhaps you need to be somewhere with less distractions. Let's see what I can arrange. What is going on? That was intense. Yeah, are restaurant critics always this scary? There's something familiar about him. Oh, another newspaper? Wow, he's really fast at writing reviews. Star restaurant scandal, no taxes paid whatsoever. We'll lock him up and throw away the key. Skull prison awarded, most secure lockup in the country. It says a new star restaurant has been caught avoiding taxes. Hey, uh, we didn't forget to pay taxes, did we? Uh, maybe forgot it once or twice. Or always. Well, this is bad. Does this mean we'll get sent to prison? Seems like it. Oh well. We had a good run. Uh... Next time on Spookware, the Skelebros escape from prison. To be continued. Oh, we finished the game so far. Ah, the big city. Truly a land of opportunity if I ever saw one. I'm gonna miss it. Are you crying? I'm not crying, you are! At least these sunglasses hide my tears. I have to say, Mitty, you made a really good pizza you made a really good pizza pie. I'm just glad I was able to work at my potential for once. Well, for a while at least. Lefty. What? Did you just do an Italian accent? I'm so proud of you. Thanks for helping out with the restaurant, little buddy. You're welcome. Wait, what did you do, righty? I counted the money. Very important job. 
Isn't it a bit weird that there's a temple right next to Bonehattan? Wait, weren't we on that bus for like six hours? How would you know? You napped through most of it. To be fair, you were playing some relaxing tunes. I wonder. Do you think the master of Umami knew we would end up in prison? Maybe that's what he meant. Or that weird critic. Come to think of it, that critic felt really familiar. Right? Something's up with that guy. At least he liked the food. Oh, Bones, I don't want to go back to prison. When did you ever go to prison? I don't know. I just feel like I'm the kind of guy that would. Well, for all we know, prison is a really lovely place. Why does this always happen to us? Achievement unlocked next time on Spookware. Oh. Wow, I... like this game a whole lot. Um, the characters and writing are really good. The mini games, of course, are a lot of fun and walk that line between being a, not frustrating they're challenging most of the time I feel like I need to go through them once before I really understand what's going on sometimes occasionally I would get it right first try but it never put you back it never got rid of progress to the point that it was frustrating it was always a very quick jump back in to get back to where you were um, I just I'm, I'm so dread XP and the games they publish, like with the Dreadx collections and stuff, it's so cool to see a game like this that started out as a small project on Itch.io that was strictly just a collection of these micro games evolve into something like this with a full game with its own narrative, its own characters. The writing's great, the music's great. I just, I really like it, and I, it's just, it's really, really cool to see something go from that to this, and um, the fact that they want to continue developing and adding story to the game. I'm really excited about that. I would love to continue to play the, the chapters on the channel. Um, and I mean, I, I have a lot of fun playing it too. Um, so yeah, I, I think Spookware is definitely one of the best things that Dread XP has brought out so far. I love the collections as well, but like this just feels really polished and very well-rounded. Um, and I, I really enjoyed it. So I'm not sure what the timeline looks like for the, um, the chapter releases, but you can bet I'm going to keep an eye on it. And like, it just has so much heart. I don't know. It, um, it, it's just, it feels really, it, it's got a good sense of humor about it and doesn't take itself very seriously. And um, I, I really like that in games. So I, um, I hope you guys enjoyed Spookware. I unlocked new tapes. Click the tape collection in the basement. Hmm. Okay. I got an achievement in Bonelicious. DLC. Okay, so there's going to be 10 chapters. 11, 12 chapters. Wow. Okay. Um, let's pop in the basement real quick. And I just want to see tape-wise. Can I skip this? Yes. So, can I go back in here? Yes. Yeah, and so they have practice tape, show stats, add to remix, remix options. That's cool, you can create your own remixes so let's see I, I bet i missed one recipe yeah i missed one recipe i don't know where that was in the city but i have everything else other than one more from the um from the looks like the basement chapter okay very cool and again if you were a person that liked the um just the original game and you just wanted to play the micro games like you could just have a blast with this making your own playlists and stuff and, and playing those too so it really it really does give um has something for everybody. If you were looking for more of a full-featured game, that's here. 
if you just want to play through the games the micro games you can do that too so i hope you guys enjoyed spookware i had a ton of fun playing it and again thank you so much to star and the folks over at red xp for giving me a key to this one something i was really looking forward to releasing this year and uh, I'm definitely glad to check it out and play it on the channel. So um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribing. I upload content like this all the time and I will see you back very soon with another video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.